The sisters will tell you they do that to cover emotional trauma. Yes. <laughs> what is it that is dead in your life that you won't go to attend to? It's going to be a long time when you hear. And I'm believing God with you. Amen. That by the time I'll believe in this land, mm. you will have a reason to thank God. Amen. Amen. By the time I'll believe in here, you have a reason to praise God. Amen. That you have encountered grace. Amen. And your life is not remain the same. Amen. 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 Start to look in the spring. The presence of God is already in this house. I can feel it. I can feel the presence of God. 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 Man, I cannot talk to you quickly before we pray that prayer. There's something that the Lord is dropping in my spirit. Come, let me pray for you quickly. Come, let me pray for you quickly. There's something that the Holy Ghost is telling me. There's something that the Holy Ghost is dropping in my spirit. Thank you, Spirit of God. Man, I got it. Man, come. Just come. What a person is right. You go to become the earth. This is what I see in the realms of the Spirit. Number one, I see two plates that they play the eat for. I see two plates in the hands of this woman. Now, the first plate that the woman was holding, I saw her coming broken. And I was asking the angel of the Lord, what is this? And anytime you see plates that are broken, it's marriage that is broken. The first one is broken. But there's a new one in the hands of this woman. And I'm asking that the angel of the Lord, what is happening? And the angel said, if prayer is not made for this one, the same thing that happened time back will happen again. I've never, had, I've never had a broken marriage before. You had a broken marriage before. You had a broken marriage before. Something happened. Have you married again? Made this year. Where is the man? Are you the new man? January. January. January on your forehead. On your forehead. January. Which month were you born? January. I see the same January on the on the forehead. Amen. Now I am standing. I am standing between ten and eighteen. Ten and eighteen. Ten and eight. You are. And you are eighteen. Come on. Something is happening around your spirit. And the Lord said, "I must help you, this woman." Now hear this. She has all that it takes to be a wife. But there's something that forces of darkness have taken from her life. Her womb has been tampered with. Wow. Yes. It is a spiritual thing. The womb has been tampered with. Oh, Jesus Christ. The womb has been tampered with. Ah, did I see this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it was, now hear me. There's this old woman that has been ascended spiritually to monitor you. The woman visited you in your dream. When the woman appeared, the assignment of the woman was to fix something for this woman to take in. And the very moment the woman left, you woke up and you felt that something spiritual had been injected to you. The angel of the Lord said, it's a spirit that has been assigned to monitor your life. Wow. You have a job. Come take the audio for me, Mama. How are you doing? I'll come, I'll come to make time. I'll soon make time. Do you, you know why 
I asked this one to bring this one. Uh, this one is a uniform person. A uniform, like in a uniform. Like in a security agency. And I see this one arresting this woman. I see this one arresting this woman in the realm of the spirit. And I see the angel of the Lord, what is happening. I don't know, but I see you surrounded with children. You. You are surrounded by children. Yes. You are surrounded by children. Yes. There's an arrow that has been shot into the children that are surrounding you. And so prematurely, there are three children that are supposed to disappear. And it's going to be a new type of demand for your arrest.
Sometimes in the realms of the spirit. There's a mantle upon your head that has not been activated. And that mantle has attracted many battles around your life. And you don't even know how to deal with it. There's a serious prophetic mantle upon your head. There's a serious prophetic mantle upon your head. And that has become the cause of your many battles you don't even know their source. Hey, stop. This woman.